So I want to show some of the um, adaptations that I have prepared for when the babies come that are particularly useful for wheelchair users, especially quadriplegics that have any kind of um, dexterity issues like I do. I can kind of grasp things, but I don't have a very strong grip and my fingers don't really work individually. I think that you're gonna like the ideas. So the first thing is this Chico 360 degree swivel high chair. It actually swivels. So you lift this and turn and it'll click into place. So now, you know, if I'm coming in this way, that's actually facing me which makes it way easier to get a baby inside. The other thing that I wanted to show everybody um, is the co-sleeping setup that I have in our bedroom. This is called a sidecar crib. I'm gonna need to be really close to the babies because it's just so hard for me to get in and out of bed physically. This was the cheapest crib I could find. It's from Ikea. It was probably $80. Rudy went ahead and made it taller to get it flush with the height of our mattress, as you can see. Since we're gonna have twins, there's going to be a lot of diaper changes. In the first few weeks, there's gonna be about 20 a day. <laughs> uh, yes, that is 20 poopy diapers a day. So uh, our future is bright and smelly. <laughs> there are no diaper changing tables that you can roll under. We basically got something that ended up being a lot cheaper and this is a big card table. As you can see, I can roll right under it and get nice and close to the baby changing table and we have Nice view as well. So here is the Ubi diaper pail. And the reason I got this one is because it doesn't have a foot pedal to open it. So this is good for quads because it has this ring. So it's perfect. You know, if you don't have good dexterity or a grip, you just stick your thumb in it. And you can open and close it just like that, just by sticking a thumb in. You don't have to be able to pinch or grab anything. And this just slides right back under the diaper changing table. And I'm definitely gonna show all this stuff again when I actually have the babies in five or six short weeks. <laughs> um, I'll show everything to you guys again, show you how it all works when I actually have live human children with me okay thank you thanks for watching